Hello everyone, Ken here. If you aren't familiar with my channel, I'm a data science consultant who makes videos about data science and sports analytics. In my work, one of the biggest challenges that I see is that companies struggle to integrate data science with their current workflow. It isn't as simple as hiring new data scientists and putting them to work. There are specific steps that you need to take to set your organization up for success within this field. In this video, I'll walk through these six specific steps that I believe will help you successfully integrate data science into your business. Watch till the end because step six is the one that holds most organizations back. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. And if you want to see more content at the intersection of data science and sports analytics, please consider subscribing to my channel. All right, let's get started. As you know, data science is all the rage these days and companies that don't adopt it will eventually fall behind. These are now my recommendations of how to integrate this field into your business and make it truly work for you. Step one, understand what data science is and what it isn't. Before you blow your entire budget on data science resources, you should take some time to learn about the field. Data science is a way to incrementally improve your decision-making, but you won't likely receive returns immediately. It could take months or years, depending on your team. Data science is definitely not a silver bullet, but if done correctly, it will improve your business outcomes. If you expect too much or too little, you'll likely be disappointed in the results here. Step two, you should audit your data fluency. In a previous video, which I've linked above, I talk about the levels of data fluency within an organization. You should evaluate where your company stands before pursuing data science further. Like a supercar without gas, data science won't move very fast without quality data. If you're at one of the earlier stages of data fluency, you should focus on resources to improve your data strategy and your data quality. Step three, identify a small project and give data science a try. If you're new to data science, I recommend trying a small project using internal resources or an outside consultant. This is a great way to expose your organization to the concept and to get a quick win without having to hire an entire team. This can also help you to understand your company's capabilities and the sentiment within your organization towards the data science field. If you're a business that's looking for more information about these types of projects and, and learning about data science consulting, feel free to reach out to me via LinkedIn or via my business email, which is in the about section of this page. Step four, you should hire the right people. After this point, you should be able to determine if data science is a good fit for your company right now. The first step towards integrating data science into your organization is hiring the correct people. Your first data science hire should be able to do data science work, but should also be capable of establishing a data strategy for your organization. I personally recommend hiring someone you'd like to manage your data science team going forward. If you hire a bunch of data scientists right away and then later hire a person to manage them, your employees could be miserable if they, if they don't get along with that person. Give your first data science hire some autonomy to hire his or her own team. Step five, get buy-in across your company. In my opinion, getting buy-in is what determines if a data science team will be successful or end up in mediocrity. Your organization has to find them useful and it's your job as a leader of your company to set them up for success. It's easy for data science team to be pulled many different directions and at the beginning, your team should be focused on clearly defined projects. I believe that being pulled in multiple directions starts the downfall of many great data science teams. The last step, step six, is to create a data-driven culture. Many companies may not actually get to this stage, but I believe that if you make it this far, you'll be setting your company up for unprecedented growth going forward. At this stage, you should be integrating data science into most of the projects that you work on. Your team should now be large enough to handle this extra capacity. Having a data scientist or an analyst touching most of the areas of your business can bring a unique perspective and can limit rework later on. Additionally, if data scientists begin to truly learn your business, they can eventually start thinking of ways that can improve processes on their own. I really hope that this video will help you move your business forward. Thank you so much for watching and good luck on your data science journey.